Hello there, Pants and General People, and welcome to the latest recording by Goddess BS. Yes, you are watching Pants and General, and let me start by thanking History Nerd. Um, he, the man was so kind enough to mention uh, me in his uh, description, you know, linking this, this Let's Play in his description. So, yes, thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. And now I'll load this game because we're in England turn number 5 September 9, 1940 and the weather is still good 11 turns remaining and I don't remember if I said it already but I am going for a minor victory in this scenario and you know the main reason is because I love the, uh, the Balkans I it's one of my favorite uh, scenarios in this campaign so yeah I definitely want definitely want to play it and for that reason uh, we are not going to defeat the English right now what I am going to do as I have mentioned in the, the comment section of one of Mr. Critic's videos you know the man that likes to tell jokes and I've committed myself to tell one also so here we go. Um, you know, I do like to visit prostitutes once in a while. Remember, I am telling jokes. But you know, I got a wife and a son. But a man, yeah, a man understand those things. You know, prostitutes, prostitutes are different. So, yeah, I visited one uh, a week ago, and uh, I asked her how much, and she told me fifty euros, and. Yeah, you know, I said I only got twenty. Yeah. No, no, no. I will not do it for twenty. Yeah. But uh, there's a Russian colleague of mine who uh, is working uh, at the end of the street over here, six uh, six doors away, and she will do it for twenty. And you get something to drink also. Okay. So I thought, well, no problem. You know, let's do it. So I went out the door, went six doors further, and you know, knocked on the window. And uh, I asked, hello, my lady friend, uh, how much does it cost uh, for sexy, sexy love? And uh, she told me, uh, 20 euros, yeah, 20 euros. And I thought, well, okay, let's make it happen, you know. Uh, and then she told me, uh, just one thing, uh, my friend, I have to sell. I have no clitoris. And I just said to her, oh, no problem, lady friend, just give me a Jägermeister. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go. And let us take a look at the map. Uh, a little bit longer. As we can see, uh, we do see a little bit of London over here. We cannot see this air defense anymore, which is on this airport. And, well, we got a whole lot of fog of war over here and over here. So, yeah, we definitely need to do some scouting. And for that purpose, I will use this level bomber. and you will move over here so we can see what's going on in these cities I will not protect it because the enemy has got no fighter that can hurt us at the moment and uh... well you know if he does no problem it's only auxiliary I don't like to lose units but he cannot see us so no problem Now we can see a bit more, you know, air defense, infantry, anti-tank gun, but we want to see more. So first, let us attack this infight now with this destroyer, please a good result. Oh, nice, I like that very much. I'll tell you why, because now, hopefully, we can destroy it with this battleship. Very 
very nice. You know, now I can give elite replacements to this guy and take the over this city with this infantry. And I'll do it right now. So, there you go. Well, very lucky to uh, to have made this happen because uh, yeah, I didn't expect it to happen, you know. But two kills with that destroyer really uh, gave us an opportunity. So yeah, very nice. Now these subs they come closer. This T-boat, you can do some spotting over here, scouting, so we can see what's going on in this city, and we see an inf, and we see this Spitfire over here. So he's bought another one. Alright, so one more torpedo boat left. And the enemy has still got a crippled battleship or battle cruiser somewhere. So yeah, no chance he's over here. And probably over here. So this T boat. And this city is occupied also. We'll move over here. And there we go. One infantry and one battle cruiser. Now, I will not send my level bomber to take care of this battle cruiser. Our navy can do that job. Lots and lots of units in the area who can do it. Instead, let us attack this fighter. You know, probably supported by air defense, but guess the fuck we need to get rid of this one. So. Firing at the same time. Ah. What a terrible result. Now, please get rid of him. This will cost us a lot of prestige to get these fighters back up to full strength again. Now, we are going to celebrate 4 stars of experience with attacking this air defense right now. And we killed 2. Very nice. Ammo of 3 left. Okay. So yeah, four starts of experience, four or six right now. Okay. Now, we know there's an air defense over here. But, uh, we have seen in the previous turn that there is no enemy over here. Now, he could have moved the unit over here. No. So let us advance and attack this air defense. Alright. So now, can we destroy it with this fighter perhaps? Zero four. So. Come on. Does no damage. And kill it. Okay, now we've got to take care of this air defense also. But first I want to hit it with this battleship. Uh, so first I want to move these units. It's going off. We see another infantry. Just 
Just move. Wow. Just move over here. We cannot use you. One kill. you anymore also and now we attack this air defense come on good result please oh very nice let's move over here and this heavy cruiser can attack this light anti-tank gun but it is heavily entrenched so and over strength. And move north also. Now this tank. Get rid of this air defense. And take this airfield at the same time. Okay. Now we use a level bomber to attack this guy. Well, let's bomb the hell of this bastard right now. We killed two, very nice. So we got two very elite tactical bombers over here. Both have got 462 and the other guy something like that also. Both in the 460s. Um, so I hope they will get to 5000 experience in this scenario and I think they will. And one of these guys Yes, that will be this guy. You attack this infantry right now. Ah, five. Very nice. Four eighty seven. So uh seventy eight. Very nice results. Yes, I think I will use this guy on this anti-tank gun. Come on. Okay, good results. And now this anti-tank gun also. Okay. Yeah, this one cannot reach anything. Have we got one more unit in the area? Yes. This guy. Now you will attack this infantry. Very good results. Okay, now let's first take out this fort. Surrender. Now we go for this anti tank.
very nice okay so we could get rid of this info with this tank but you know we've got him surrounded right now Let's get rid of this inf. So we've got to move this tank. Because then we can get one X closer. And let's attack this infantry. Zero three. Let's go. Four. Nice. Oh, very nice. So we see more air defense, infantry, infantry. Okay, so where were we? Over here. Uh, then again, since this attack with this level bomber went so well, you know. Yeah. Let's try this. And it does surrender. Nice. Okay. Let's get rid of you. Ah. Totally forgot about my artillery. Ah oh, well, why not use it? can handle this tank. Let's move it the range over there. Let's attack this tank right now. go, very nice. Hmm. Yeah, let's move over here. And now we get rid of this tank. Ah, damn it. Oh, damn it, damn it. Oh. Should have placed my tank over here, you know. Then I, my plan was to take out this uh, infantry right here. Hopefully with this guy, and then attack with my bridging engineers here. God damn it! Fuck. Oh well, well. maybe. We've 
got some units over here, of course. What am I thinking? So. Yeah, come on, this tank. Okay, bye bye. Now both say zero seven. Let's get rid of this fort first. Nice. And so we take over London. Now another Panzer. And a Wehrmacht. Flak. Yeah, my plan for this tank was to attack this guy, you know, so... But... The opportunity uh, came, so... Yeah, you know, we've got to change it a little now. And... Well... Sorry. Okay. Yes, so we have moved you. One more tank. This tank. Okay. Just attack. This is a uh, stuck by the way. Now, can we destroy you with this recon? And we can see what's going on over here. Come on. So we fire first. Yes. And a bridging engineer together with an air defense. 40 millimeter. Now our flag and our Panzer 3G. You will go over here. And this flag also. Okay. Now, where do, do we place you? Just here, I think, for the moment. Well, maybe we need... Yeah, we got lots and lots of units over here. Well, well, well. Sorry, we'll just place it over here then. Okay, so we got the Stuck. Over here, and we 
get another level bomber left. Yeah, get a level bomber left over here also. Because I want to send some units north right now. But first, let us disembark these units. So we land on the river over here. Well, let's go for this city then, I think. Hmm. Yeah. Yes. These paratroopers, this city should be empty, and the city is empty, and the airfield is empty. I knew it. And now we've got artillery over here. And yeah, you have to advance. But first, let us take care of these units. Now, tank. And this tank will just move over here and not attack. You know, just provoke an attack. Now I would just place my units. Well, no. you're good. We'll place this unit over here. Our artillery. Can go over here. And this guy also. Yeah, we've got air units left, but... Going to play uh, the ground units a bit this defensive in this part just to uh, get them uh, in place at the right uh, you know get them in the right place want to attack this air defense want to attack this anti-tank gun and things like that you know Okay, level bomber. You can attack this city, but you cannot see it. So, why not attack this city? And now we can see what's going on. And no air defense. Now I'll send my level bomber over here also so you can help. Okay. And now this fighter will attack. So we kill four. And I want to take a look what's going on in this city. So let's fly over here. Oh, let's 
maybe a little bit too far. Here's far oh. enough. Okay, so infantry and air defense. Yes, we get a couple of more fighters. This anti tank is not covered by air defense. And we've got an infantry over here. Well, this rookie fighter, I'd like to give it a lead right now, also. No, probably cannot do any damage right now while it's at 60%. Got a few turns left. Yeah, I'm not sure. You know, I don't want to waste. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. I don't want to waste a turn also for this guy, but. Yeah. Not sure yet. This guy will attack these paratroopers. He will also go along with uh, our other Fallschirmjäger, which, is, which are uh, on this side over here. Okay, now the next units. Yeah, these guys. Hmm. Well, well, well. I think. Yeah, let's move it over here. So now we can disembark this uh, Fashemjäger. And let's fly. Well. Why fly in this spotting range? Oh, just fly here. Okay, now you can advance and you can attack this air defense. Let's go! Now another level bomber. We could attack this guy, but yeah, why? Hmm. Yeah, you haven't got a whole lot of ammo. Let's attack this city. And these bridging engineers will go on a transport and move over here. So, yeah, we can... Uh, Cross the river, wipe it out, and form a bridge. Okay, so yeah, last unit, this fighter. Now, see, let's see, can we do any damage? 
Unfortunately not. Uh, but no problem. And this turn. Yes. So yeah, he will fire at us. At least he does it as it this eleven. Oh my god, five kills. Motherfucker. So now I will tank. Oh, damn it. Ah, stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. <laughs> oh, what was I thinking? I was thinking about this and I thought no problem. Because you cannot move and attack then. But of course you can. Of course you can. How much did we kill? I didn't see that. Uh, okay. Okay, no problem. So yeah, save this game. It's England uh, s uh, 6, yes. And a quick look at the casualties. So 5 air defenses right now. Out of 13 for the whole campaign. And now... Thank you guys all for watching and I'll see you next video. Bye bye.